In this video, you will learn how to monitor and control active workload using CA Workload Automation DE Desktop Client. Suppose that you define an application and schedule it in the defined perspective. You can monitor and control the application and its jobs in the monitor perspective when it runs. For this demonstration, let us first download and schedule an existing Verify application in the defined perspective. The Verify application is downloaded. For this demonstration, let us enable the Hold on Submission option in the application. When this option is enabled, the server holds the application and all its jobs from submission until the application is manually released. Now, let us upload the modified application to the server. Next, trigger the event manually. Leave the Schedule Criteria field blank so that the application is run immediately. Next, let us navigate the Monitor Perspective to monitor the active workload. Using the Monitor Perspective, you can monitor the state, view the details or issue command against the application or the jobs within the application. To monitor the active workload, you must first subscribe to the active workload on the server. All the active application generations appear under the server. As the application was submitted on hold, the application and its jobs are in application hold state. In this state, the application is held from submission and the submission of jobs is also stopped. Next, let us see how to control the active workload. The actions commands for an application are displayed based on its state. Similarly, the actions commands for a job are also displayed based on its state. To release the held application and start the processing of the jobs, issue the release application command. The server released the held application and started processing the jobs with the application. Note that the application state is changed from application hold to processing. Similarly, the job status is changed from application hold to execution. The progress bar at the top displays the start time, estimated end time, and completion percentage of the application. The jobs within the application are completed, hence the application moved to the complete state. In this video, you have learned how to monitor and control active workload using CA Workload Automation DE Desktop Client.